Hi Taurus, I hope you're doing well. So we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about here for January. We have Knight of Pentacles, Magician, Emperor, Four of Swords, solid energy coming through. This is someone who's in their thoughts very persistent. Someone who's wanting to take control, action towards you. I don't see this person backing down or giving up on this connection. They're determined here. They're, they're invested. They're wanting to give to you. How you're being perceived is as emotionally unstable. Some of you unavailable. Knight of Wands, Ace of Wands. Why is this person perceiving Taurus as King of Cups in reverse? If it is someone you've been on again, off again with, you may have pulled back your love because you felt you were being breadcrumbed, right? It's sort of on again, off again, sometimes leaving you lonely, vulnerable. Why is higher? This can be even someone that you were married to. But a lot of you, I feel like it may be new love. Yeah, it, it can be that you're coming out of a long-term commitment and this is the energy you're embodying. Someone who's very desirable, confident. At least that is how you're being perceived. Very desirable. Wow. Yeah, you're not wanting to be a part of, you know, this drama, conflict, situations that aren't on your level. This person, whoever you are thinking about, is seeing you rising above here. In their feelings, we have Six of Pentacles, Judgment. Some of you, they want to repeat this with you, have a second chance. Others of you, it's just a new person that has their eye on you. You've caught someone's eye. Someone that's wanting to take you out on a date, invest in you, give to you Six of Pentacles. Clarify Six of Pentacles upright for this person's feeling. Look, look at that. Very attracted. Emperor, Ace of Wands can be a fire sign. They definitely want you physically, but there's also emotions here. Clarify judgment. It's like someone wanting to take care of you. If you're completely single, there's like a new love coming in. <laughs> Look at all the aces. And just when I said there's new love coming in, someone is um, communicating their feelings to you. Two of cups, ace of swords, judgment. Sometimes judgment, ace of swords can be that light bulb moment. Someone that wasn't seeing the connection or they were holding back their emotions and they're being more it's just, you know, it could even be that situation where someone was uncertain of how they were feeling. There was some confusion. Or there was fear of rejection and they're getting that clarity that, you know, feelings perhaps are mutual. It's safe to love Taurus. There's, I saw three aces come through. So if you feel there's no way a past person and you can reunite or whatever, unite, then this is new love. It's like a happier cycle. This is faded. I, this is the most positive. You know, you're the last reading I'm filming and it's the best reading. Their intentions, Wheel of Fortune. Clarify Wheel of Fortune for this person's intentions towards Taurus. who's manifesting you. Also someone who's wanting to bend. If it's someone who has control issues, you know, very rigid, it's like, let's see where this goes. I'm letting loose a bit. Let I'm going with the flow. But there's something about destiny coming in. Three major arcana. It's like they feel this pull towards you. They can't explain it. It's a slow-moving energy. Okay, 
Taurus, if you're completely single, you may be feeling very left out. Five of Pentacles, nothing works out for me. I, I, I understand because this is very slow moving energy. Whatever you're manifesting, it's coming in. It's dependable. It's the real deal. And it's the best. You have an emperor coming towards you, but it is taking time. Don't give up on your manifestations. But again, I do see someone, you know, some of you dealing with this person currently and they're dragging their feet, but they are coming towards you. They're waiting for that right opportunity. Yeah, there was something about bad timing here. Wow. Whoa. Did you see all the major arcana in that too upright? Oh my goodness. Actually, if I look at majority of your major arcana are upright. You're very desirable, beautiful. A good looking couple I'm getting here. Emperor and Empress with Venus here with justice. What action they'll take? Ace of Cups. Presenting you with an offer. That's what action they're taking. It's like asking you out on a date for drinks, watching you closely. Relationship. If you're stuck in this toxic relationship, someone you're not seeing eye to eye with, someone who has control issues, they're emotionally manipulative, there's a lot of arguments, there's some healthier uh, connection coming up for you. Don't compromise or settle for less. Someone who's making you feel like this five of pentacles, you deserve better. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Some hierophant in reverse is non-committal and that is how you are being perceived but it can also be coming out of a you know long-term relationship or some sort of uh, even thought pattern that we're breaking free from right that's not working for us any longer so there's a change in perspective here as well that is bringing in a lot of blessings and new love here I'm seeing a lot of fours come through. It's a happy, healthy relationship. In your feelings, we have page of swords, six of wands, and reverse. Some of you could be putting yourself out there, getting to know new people. See, page of swords as a student is a very inquisitive sort of energy where we're curious, we're wanting to explore new territory. But sometimes six of wands in reverse can be few things. One, it can be a lack of confidence. Also coming through with the page definitely is telling me lack of confidence. Or it can be that there's offers being presented to you, but they may not be at your level. There may be trust issues here. You'll have your reasons, right? They're not really interested in what is being presented to you. Four of Cups. So as a result, you're quite guarded here. It's like you have to be worthy for me to get up from my throne and invest myself. Until then, I'm coming through as reserved. Suspicious, rightfully so. It's because of past experiences. Let's clarify the six of wands in reverse. There's insecurities coming through in your energy. Yeah, and it can be because of someone who was in and out, someone that ghosted, unrequited love is breadcrumbing really is what I'm getting. Ooh. Yeah, you have a dream relationship uh, coming up here. Someone who's in their masculine energy, someone you've prayed for, you've wished for. And if you intuitively feel there will be reconciliation, which is coming through, yeah, you both will heal. Especially if you're living with this person, this is your significant other, there will be recovery here. After a period of bad luck is what is um, continuously coming through. Your outcome, we have five of pentacles, justice upright. Let's clarify this. Yeah, it's like not seeing your worth and how desirable you are it can be because of one specific energy. There's people that would die to be with you, really. 
you're the best and you need to see that in you. Some of you may be concerned because you may be a single parent. This can be some legalities that we're needing to take up care of. Custody battle even with the Five of Wands. Because I do see a breakup here. Yeah, it's like unrequited love. Someone you're not communicating with, you're on a break. This King of Wands in reverse. Grass is greener on the other side. That's their loss that they didn't see you for who you are. But there is someone that is seeing you exactly for who you are. I want to clarify justice here for you. And by the way, Empress here, two different decks coming through upright. Why is justice here for Taurus outcome? Oh yeah, it's like rest, take a chill. You have nothing to take a chill. Chill, chill out, keep your thoughts positive, know your worth, and they're coming. Some of you, they're already here. Yeah, this one-sided situation wasn't worth your effort. If someone isn't treating you as a priority, that's what I'm getting. It's like you are putting in all the effort. But this next person, they're willing to fight for you. In this person's outcome, we have Empress Ten of Wands. Do you see how this person's carrying all these load, these wands, walking towards the Empress? Yeah, it's someone who will treat you with a lot of respect and they'll be putting in a lot of work, effort to be with you. Ten of Wands. Wands are always taking action towards another. Sorry if that hurt your ear, but Knight of Pentacles. It's a very hardworking um, individual. Maybe someone that you have your eye on here as well, or they have their eye on you. It's watching you, your social media for some of you, their, your pictures. It's like you're aesthetically very pleasing. You're pleasing to the eye. It's something along those lines. You have a very beautiful aura. Why is Ten of Wands here? Eight of Wands, yeah, someone who's wanting to communicate, make plans to travel towards you, to see you, but it's consistent communication, Ace of Swords. Oh yeah, look at this beautiful match. It's beautiful. King of Pentacles, Queen of Wands, Ace of Swords. A lot of communication coming in. Five, five. A lot of challenges here when it comes to your love life here in the past. You know, it, it would have played out in different ways for each one of you. See, Five of Pentacles can be ghosting situation, lack of appreciation, insecurities. But it's talking about struggles, and that is what is turning around for you. In your advice, we have Two of Cups, World Universe. It's not over. It's reminding me of that uh, love sketch, Oracle, where it's saying, don't turn your back on love. It's not over. You have true love here coming in. But some of you, it definitely can be with the world in reverse. Uh, someone from your past returning. And there's mutual feelings, you being on the same page. Let's see what comes through. Majority of you though, Taurus, it feels like a new love. What can Taurus expect in their love life moving forward? Trust the plan. And wasn't I getting strong influence right of destiny fate when you least expect it it's like you're not in control here there's a higher force at work which is why they were saying um just chill it's not in your hands trust will be rebuilt if it's someone from your past what can Taurus expect in their love life? Moving forward. Taurus. That really wanted to. Tempting offer. We have divine mission together. Do you see that? Trust the plan. Divine mission.
extremely protected. I don't think you even realize how protected you are. Completely single judgment, six of pentacles, assistance from above. Look at that. I cannot. Do you see not a lot of cards in this oracle? Um, reference back to like higher power, divine timing, but you have all of them. Quality time together, divine timing, magic happens when you let go. I don't even know. The gates of love are open. Sudden change. That's what you can look forward to. So if your love life has been challenging, it's a happier cycle coming in for you. Major, major. Home. Location change. Change in the home. Feeling of home. A new cycle for you. New beginnings. The ending of a cycle. Making a fresh new start. Some of you may be relocating, and that can be a new cycle. It's bringing in this new revitalizing energy. I cannot with you knowing the path. Wow. Yeah, this was some lesson you were learning with the Five of Pentacles world in reverse. We have love lessons learned, shift in perspective. Didn't I say that? And we have raising your vibration. And we have first love, but I was getting true love with the Two of Cups. No one compares to you. First true love, new love experiences. Knowing the path, aligning with your purpose, accepting your story, you're on the right track. So if that is what you're worried about, I'm running out of time. I don't know, do I have to do this to find the one? Blah, blah, blah. You know, our thoughts can run wild. They're saying, just relax. <laughs> it, this is faded. Trust the plan. You're on the right path. You're exactly where you need to be. I'm also seeing cursed and reconciliation. Someone who is running. I was seeing old boy kids in love trip. What advice do you have for Taurus? Waiting, and that three is a crowd. If you're waiting on someone who put you in a third party, they're saying, is it worth wasting your time waiting on someone when you could be experiencing something way better here that I do see in your future? Angel messages. Assistance from above, judgment, six of pentacles. Pay attention and observe what is happening within and around you. Your angels are sending you messages and signs. Six of pentacles, like dropping hints here and there. And special event. Fate will play a role in your love life. Pay attention to the people who come into your life unexpectedly. Stay curious and keep exploring. Don't give up. You were curious, inquisitive, energy, page of swords. Six of Wands, sometimes feeling of wanting to give up. Queen vibes or king vibes, you really stepped up your game, Empress. Now let them meet you there. Don't you dare take off your crown for them or anyone. Remember that. The best reading, I'm telling you, this is no joke. Did you see the number of major arcana that came through? And that too upright? How many times did we get curiosity for you? Or keep exploring? Look at the cat smelling the flowers here. They're saying curiosity and say yes. Reclaim your curiosity and have some fun. Don't take life so seriously. Take a chance and say yes. Yes to that offer. You're getting an offer. What action someone was taking? Ace of Cups. Take that offer. Yes to romance and yes, you are ready for this when this offer comes in and when i cut the deck angelic help you have angels who are near ready to assist you in your growth and in accomplishing your divine life purpose the star 
Shoot for the stars, don't you dare settle for fine. Set your sights higher, you deserve better. Closure. Sometimes the only closure you need is understanding that your soul deserves peace. Your soul deserves peace. Four of swords. Okay, Taurus, that is what I have for you. You have nothing to worry about. The most divinely guided, protected sign that I've seen ever on this channel. Perhaps you really need to hear this message because of this energy, right? But it's temporary. Five of Pentacles, it's a minor arcana. Surrounding it, we have two major arcana, Empress and Justice. It's like being back on track. Perhaps someone led you astray or caused you to doubt, question yourself here. It's just a little glitch and you'll be up and flourishing again. That is what I have for you. Take care of yourself and I'll see you soon. Bye.